I have been using Obsidian as a task manager for the past two years. I have used almost all of the plugins like tasks, cardboard. I have uh, used the Kanban plugin, tasks calendar, uh, tasks timeline, and almost every possible solution that you can think of. And recently, I discovered this new plugin that just completely blew my mind. It was simple yet so perfect for task management in Obsidian. With a markdown based editing tool like Obsidian, which is primarily focused on note taking, you should not expect a full fledged task management like the standalone task management apps do. But with this plugin, a lot of what I wanted in a task management system in Obsidian is fulfilled for me. And in this video, I'm going to share everything about this plugin and how you can start using it for a better task management system within Obsidian. Before we begin the video, if you are using a Mac, you can try out my new application called as VoiceSync, which is a voice-to-text application powered by local whisper models. It can save you a lot of your time if your time involves mostly writing. The link will be in the description. Thank you for checking out. Let's get back to the video now. Let's begin the video. So you can see here, this is the task dashboard created by this plugin, where you have the today's view over here with to do in progress and done section where you can easily move these tasks from one view to another view and they will automatically change their status as well. And here we have backlog section tomorrow, Friday, Monday and other dates as well as weeks and months section as well. If you hide the empty container, it will only show uh, containers that have tasks in there. We'll talk about all of this in the latter part. Let's first start with the installation and how you can configure this uh, plugin. This is the plugin that we're going to talk about today, Proletrian Wizard Task Manager. And it makes it so much easier to manage tasks within Obsidian. I'll click on enable and if you go to options, here are a few options. How many daily work in progress limit do you want? Now you can uh, write the number of tasks that you want to see in the daily column. Uh, or daily view then you have the option to add ignored folders if you have certain folders where you have checkbox items that are not necessarily tasks that you want to do but they are checklist items then you can ignore uh, these folders over here then you can ignore uh, these folders over here then you have the option to ignore the archive to do which will ignore to do's in the file under archive folder then you have the attributes over here which are due completed and selected so i'll close this one and after you have installed the plugin you have the ribbon menu over here okay it will open the uh, daily planner like this now this is your task management view and this lets you plan and prioritize your tasks better and this plugin does not depend on any other plugins like tasks plugin some of the other solutions that we have talked previously in this channel depend on the tasks plugin but this does not this is a standalone independent plugin now let us see how you can use this okay this plugin will treat any of the tasks you have in your vault in any file or in any node as a task i'll just create a new folder new node over here and it will automatically appear over here any tasks that do not have a due date will appear in the backlog and you can see these tasks have a due date that is why they are appearing on specific columns i'll write task to task now all you need to do is move these tasks and prioritize when you want to do okay i'll just move it to tomorrow section and it will automatically add a new information to the task item that is uh, adding a due date similarly i'll add task 2 over here and task 3 over here and all of these tasks have a due date and if you complete these tasks directly from here you will have a completed date and the task will be completed to plan and prioritize your tasks, you can just move it to the today sections to do or if it is in progress, you can move it to progress section and it will have this uh, different kind of checkbox item which indicates the task is in progress. After the task is finished, you can click on this checklist item and it will be moved to done section. So this is really simple implementation for task management in Obsidian and I have seen no other plugins do it. There was a plugin called as Cardboard which tried to do similar thing like Kanban view but it was not that good it had this column view but you were not able to move these tasks directly from one column to another column and that was a big uh, issue for my use case but with this plugin you will be able to better plan and prioritize your tasks and you can see here we have all of the sections if you want to plan a task for a few weeks from now you can just add it to four weeks from now it will appear over here and as the date appears it will slowly move into these uh, columns because we already have the due date as uh, this date 
So this is the to-do planner section by Proletrian Wizard Task Manager. There is another feature of this plugin as well, that is reports, you, where you will be able to see all of the tasks that you have completed previously. Uh, you can see here, uh, this is uh, from December 30 to January 1. And these are the tasks that have been completed previously, but are not recognized by this plugin because here we have the completed date in the tasks format. This is one big issue with this plugin right now. If you are using tasks plugin and if you are dependent upon a lot of features like recurring tasks, setting priority, etc., it does not work yet. And there is an issue raised on GitHub by a user. So hopefully this plugin will support tasks format and different features of tasks like recurring tasks, priority setting and more. That would really be awesome. Even if it does not support all of the tasks feature, I still think I will be using this plugin for the long term because of how simple, how clean and how easy to use it is. This is a really neat implementation for task management within Obsidian. You don't need any other things. You just need to add tasks uh, like normal checklist items. And all of these uh, checklist items will appear over here. And from here, you can plan and prioritize your tasks into different days. And when that day comes, they will automatically be shown in your today's view. You can also move tasks that you want to move from other boards from here to today's view and get a better overview of all of your tasks and what you need to do. So this is all for this video. I hope you found this video useful. And if you are using Mac, you can definitely try out my application called as Voice Inc. It is a voice to text application powered by local whisper models. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you have a great time. See you again in the next video. Have a great time.